All right, welcome back to Accident. In the last episode, we did the cliffside accident, and I failed a lot. I let the car fall off the, the cliff a lot, a lot, a lot. Uh, but hopefully we do a little bit better today. So yeah, we came off the cliffside accident in uh, uh, this place in France, and now we're going to check out the street race. Oh, this is going to be good. Uh, it was cool because in the, the cliffside accident, I had like a pretty rad like Porsche. So uh, I'm curious to see some of the cars in the street race. This is in good old Tennessee, USA, in 2004. I am Wilfred Collins, the first responder. Let's go do it. Oh, what? What is this music? Holy cow, it's loud. What is going on? Am I walking? Oh, I'm walking. Wait, wait. I'm walk. Oh, oh, I was wearing headphones. What? That was so weird. So I was just walking, and then I heard street racers, and I'm coming to the scene of the action. I'm not controlling this right now. It is. We're like auto walking. I'm not doing anything. I can look. I can look around. That's about all I can do. Wow, yeah, dude, look at these cars. What? Oh, dang, okay. Uh, call the emergency. Wow, I have a much lower, 2004, wait, what was that? 90, okay, 911, it just said 91. Uh, call emergency, did I not do that? Call, call emergency, do I not have signal? What did it do, what did it say? I missed it, did my battery die? Uh, hello, can I use your phone? Uh, yes, hello. Do you have a phone? Uh, I'm gonna need a phone. Does it... I don't really understand what happened with my phone. Do you have a phone in your back seat? No? Okay. Uh, passenger, do you have a phone? I'm gonna need your phone. I'm running out of ideas. Uh, phone? Okay. Jeez, what is this car? I can't even tell. Nice, uh... Oh! Phone? No. Next race? What? Get inside. I will get inside. I really hope I can find your phone in here. This is gonna be kind of awkward. Boy, this is not a strong start. Trunk lock button unlocked. Maybe your phone's in the trunk. I don't think so. Uh, I feel like I'm wasting a lot of time not knowing how to call to uh, <laughs> how to call emergency services. Does your phone get ejected from the car? No. Uh, okay. Uh, trunk. Yikes. I'm gonna learn some stuff. I don't know what happened with my phone. Like, why? Why did I not call? Boy. Wow. I feel like I'm gonna fail this really quickly. Uh, no phone in there. Um, some, is there a payphone? Oh, payphone! Wow, you know, it's just not the first thing that jumped to my mind, I gotta be honest. 2004. Okay, 2004. Okay, yikes. We have not helped ourselves, I don't think. Though I'm ready to get the fire extinguisher. Thank you, sending help. Okay, uh, and maybe put out, it's not really on fire. Maybe I'll just pop the hood, see if there's anything under it. I don't know what it's gonna want for me. Uh, yikes, slow start, slow start. Uh, turn off the ignition in the vehicles. Okay, I can do that. Yep, off. And we're gonna get in and turn yours off. And then we're gonna mark the accident location. We have, th we need to mark it in three spots. Okay, three spots. We, I don't know how I'm gonna do this, because we're gonna have some markers. Yeah, no we're not. Emergency flares? Um. Usually, engine smoke, okay. Um, hi, do you have um, markers? Ooh, um, can I mark it with this stuff? Yikes, um, markers, flares? First aid kit, yikes, it's not good. Uh, um, I don't think this is gonna help me <laughs> at all. Uh, can I just steal from some random person's car? I, I. Uh, um, wow, what am I going to use to mark accident location? Oh, it is flares. Well, at least it's one flare. I didn't know you could do that with flares. I've actually never used flares. Oh, but we only, oh wait, no, we have more than one. Okay, okay, okay. I did not know that flares worked for this. I have never used them. Uh, all right, that's not bad. Okay, good to know. Check all victims, check your exact location. All right, let's go ahead and check on... So we've got four victims, two in that car, one in this car, and one on the ground, which is, yeah, just someone who is, like, walking. Uh, you, Freddy, do not look so hot. I gotta be honest. Uh, oh, um, okay. Oh, yeah. It's always the seatbelt. That tricks me up every time. Open the airway. Got it. Let's check your breathing. I think I'm gonna, you got some bumps on his head that we're gonna have to look at as well. You are not breathing. You've got a wound on your cheek. You've got a bruise on your head. All right, that's one. Let's check out this guy on the ground, who I also have a feeling 
might not be doing so hot. William Maddox. Um, what? Why? Why do I have to do it like this? Why do you? Oh yeah. Okay. Start with the shoulder. Got it. Uh, open the airway. He is breathing. That is impressive. Okay. He is breathing. We got a wound there. We got a wound there. We got a wound there. All right. He is breathing. William Maddox. Oh wait. Is it showing the guy in that car as alive? I didn't think I heard any breathing, but maybe he was breathing. I was talking too much to hear it, I guess. Uh, under the seatbelt, look back up, tip your head back, open the airway, and... Uh, yeah, he's breathing, okay. That's good. We are three for four right now. But that guy in the first car is the one who's hurting the most right now. Okay, seatbelt up. Airway, check for breathing. She is not breathing. Yes, she is. Okay, I cannot tell. I thought I could tell. Check my exact location. Um, yikes. There's two, two, two things. Maybe it's in this car on the. Sometimes it's like on like the, this this thing. No. Nope. That was not right. Okay. Um, check my exact location. Yikes. Uh, maybe I can use a little bit of first aid on somebody before they die. Can I do that? I don't know if I can do that yet. I might be jumping the gun here. But I feel like I'm pretty concerned that... Yeah, no, 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 not a good idea. Uh, I don't know how to check my exact location. Usually I do this in my car. Like on the head unit. Oh, oh boy. I don't know what I would use to do that right now. Okay, I'm probably going to be redoing some of this how would I... I my phone doesn't work I don't know what I'm doing I don't know how to check my location these guys are gonna die because of my negligence and I can't pull out the first day to do anything what um, back to the payphone this is not it is it I don't think so. Hi, yeah. Um, which intersection? Look for street signs. Okay, I thought about that, but I was like, no. Oh, so. What? Oh. Okay. All right. I think I think I kind of know what to do. You need to act faster. Yeah. I, I admit I I was a bit slow. I'm thinking I'm gonna start completely over, because. I know what to do now, right? All right, so that's everybody we checked on. Uh, it was definitely faster. We'll see. Now let's go check for exact location. Street sign. Okay. Oh, I gotta get very close. Okay, eighth, and uh, another street sign. Really, there's not a. Okay, there. It, wow. Mm, south. Eighth and south, of course. Okay, nice. Now we gotta go back on the phone. Pass the information to the emergency dispatcher. We're doing a lot better. This is a lot better. I think if we can maybe first aid the people, or maybe maybe they'll just send EMS now. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, drive, car driver, sports car driver is the most desi dire situation. You can pull them out, perform a CPR. Okay, got it. On it. I will I will heed your advice. Hope I can pull them this way. This is going to be kind of awkward. Oh, yep. Okay, I guess I'm going to somehow pull them out of the door that I've never been able to open. Uh, jammed. Okay, it's still. Wait, 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 what, 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 what? Oh, okay. That was kind of confusing. Got it. All right, we got Freddy Weaver out. Where did we put him? Okay, he's right behind me. All right, let's get you. Let's get you going since she said that you are the person in the worst shape. Open the kit. Open the. Open the kit. Put the mask on. Put the gloves on. Put the mask. Open the airway. Okay, it's like the order of operations. I have not done it enough to even remember. Uh, okay, and we're gonna, oh yeah, chest compressions, going too slow, or going too fast. It's telling me to go slower, but I feel like it wants me to go faster. I don't know, I, I honestly don't even know. I was like, there was, I was focusing so much and it was still really bad. Okay, this is the game of dragging your mouse up and down. Oh, crap. Uh, continue CPR until help arrives. Okay. Are we good? Okay, I think we're good. EMS, you here? Please save me. Please help me. Woo! 
okay. No one died, I don't think, so that's... That is a plus. Now, let's figure out what the cause was. I'm gonna guess the cause was street racing. I don't know why. Uh, but obviously this guy got hit in a shopping cart, which is very sad. William Maddox is hit by Freddy's sports car. Okay, so we can follow some of these screechy... Screechy line. What are these? Yeah, tire, tire tracks. Okay, anyway, cardboard is irrelevant. Okay. Got my flare. Let's see. It seems like something happened here. Oh, maybe they're going this direction. Ah, this is hard to figure out. Okay, some sort of uh, impact point. Hampton's car smashes into the sports car. Okay, more cardboard that is irrelevant. Let's see. Anything on you that we should check out? Engine smoke. Steam from a ruptured radiator. Okay. Okay. We need two more clues. Two more clues. Let's see. So you were coming this direction. I assume he, like, ripped out here. You can see the point of impact here, the T-bone. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, okay. Kind of thought there'd be something, like, here, like... Freddy punches it and rips out into the intersection and gets T-boned. Like, I don't know who was speeding. I assume it was a sports car, not this person. Like an Audi, Audi, uh, what did I say? It was like an R Audi, uh, RS5? Is that, I don't know my Audis that well. That well. Uh, okay. Or actually, someone came out this way, right? What is that? Nothing? That's can. Uh, I can't figure out exactly what happened. A pamphlet. Freddy Weaver participates in an illegal street race. Wow. Okay, that doesn't really clear up the direction for me or anything. Anything in this car? Anything in your trunk? Any surprises, any secrets in your trunk? No, no, no. Okay. Let's see, sometimes there's stuff kind of just like off the edge of the scene. Though I am trying, I just don't understand. Like, maybe it's traffic light? Like, light changes? Oh! Come on, give it to me. I worked hard for the... Uh, help. <laughs> what? There's a thing up there. Let me have you. What? <laughs> no. How? Eh. It's... I'm just thinking, like, oh, light changes. Freddy punches it, you know, whatever. Something. But I don't know. I can't... Do I have to stand... Um... What? What am I supposed to do with this? Eh, scale the pole. We need to figure out what that says. Is that it? Is that really going to be it and I don't know how to get to it? Or is it just... Maybe that's just a decoy. Uh, anything on the car? Sports car. Clue. The sports car stops in the middle of the intersection. Wow, that's not... It's weird that it was just kind of like in the trunk. All right, well, that's weird. I don't know what that was. Just, I don't know, it's just a decoy to confuse me. Let's put them in order. This is actually not as conclusive as I was hoping. Uh, all right. Freddy Weaver participates in an illegal street race. The ambulance car smashes into the sports car. So I'm thinking participation was the first problem, really. Um, the Hamptons, let's see. He hits, he hits this guy with his shopping cart. And then he stops in the middle of the intersection. And then the Hamptons car smashes into the sports car. That's my guess. Hey, nice. That was not exactly how I thought it was going to work out. Okay, William Maddox. Oh, he is dead. He died? In addition to several injuries, the crash broke William's left leg. As a result of his poor overall health, William immediately slipped into a coma. His health was so poor that he never recovered from it and died in the hospital four months later. Wow. Okay. So, like, not my fault, but that's sad. Freddy, you're the big problem here, man. Your immediate assistance saved Freddy's life. The paramedics were able to revive him on the way to the hospital where he was charged with causing serious injury by driving recklessly, which eventually resulted in a 10-year prison sentence. Dang, Freddy. Bad choice. Poor choices. Jason V. Hampton driving the blue car. Jason didn't suffer any serious injuries from the accident and was quickly released from the hospital. So he soon became interested in Freddy Weaver's case, and some believe his testimony was the main reason for Freddy's unusually high sentence, although no one was able to find any solid evidence interesting okay and his wife or i don't know 
girl, well, probably, yeah, probably wife, or, you know, sister, we don't know. Oh, no, it's definitely, definitely wife. Just like her husband, the accident didn't cause Bethany any major injuries. Just two weeks later, she was able to return to work as the mayor's assistant. Interesting. Okay, well, there you go. That is the street race scenario in Accent. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did enjoy and you want to see more videos of Accent or any of the other games I've been playing, be sure to subscribe in your way. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. See ya.